No, thanks, thanks. Last but not least, um, thanks for the invitation. It's great to have, like, this is my first offline meeting as well. And I'm very happy to hear, uh, to be here. Um, thanks for the invitation. Thanks for Asia Berlin and the great team behind it. My name is Tadeus, and I'm the founder and CEO, as well as the medical lead of Canostics. At Canostics, we are very simply trying to beat cancer, not by finding a miracle cure, but by just diagnosing it so early that it can be already cured, cured today. Everyone knows that cancer is a really horrible disease, and I believe most of you will have been in touch with it, me included, on a personal level. And by most people in the society, it is still considered to be a death sentence. And this is because worldwide, every second person will get cancer in their lifetime, and every fourth death is related to it. This accumulates to more than 10 million deaths each year. But we can change this because. 50% of these deaths could be prevented because they are solely due to a too late diagnosis. And here we see the five-year survival for lung cancer by stage. And we focus on the left side of the screen. We can very clearly see that if this really aggressive cancer is caught early on in stage one, the survival chance is actually 93%. The issue is that most people are only diagnosed in the later stages, when the survival rate really rapidly drops to 10% in stage four, and the cure is almost impossible to accomplish. This is because cancer is a very insidious disease that presents symptoms, in most cases, only very late in its course, and that the healthcare system is currently absolutely lacking the tools to diagnose the disease early on. In fact, for more than 120 types of cancer, early detection screening methods are only available to four of them. And these methods cover roughly one third of all cases, leaving us with no easy option for the other two thirds. So what can we do and how will we change the outcome for the patient? We are developing a very convenient, affordable, and foremost accessible blood test that will be able to detect the most common cancers at unprecedented accuracy. So that one day, when you go to your GP for your routine checkup of heart, liver, and kidney function, you can just get tested for cancer straight away without any additional effort, neither for you nor for your doctor. And we're doing this by combining Raman spectroscopy, which is a very sensitive laser-based measurement technology, with machine learning algorithms. The hardware component of this test already exists, so our product is limited to a constantly growing software solution that converts this existing hardware into high-throughput, fully automated cancer screening devices. That means for the test evaluation, finally, there is no medical specialist needed, which makes it accessible all over the world. So. So usually it would take like 10 to 12 years and a budget of more than 30 million dollars to translate a promising approach like this from the research laboratories into the clinics. But we have worked hard over the last couple of years to establish clinical partnerships with leading Indian Institute, which enables us to cut development time and cost by more than 70%. But we are not simply outsourcing our development to India. We have set up our own subsidiary, our own research labs, and we are in compliance with EU ethical and uh, certification guidelines from day one and from patient one. We have also assembled a multidisciplinary and really great team of highly qualified specialists spanning everything from medicine to medical physics and optical diagnostics, biochemistry and quality management, all the way to data science and business development. The business model behind this is that we will license this software solution to the hardware manufacturers which in turn can sell the existing product without any additional effort to the much more profitable and much larger medical market and to their already established network of medical laboratories and clinics. The medical laboratories and clinics in turn get the chance to add high throughput, fully automated cancer screening to their portfolio and offer it to their doctors. We'll charge the laboratories on a pay-per-use basis for the constantly learning and evolving evaluation database. So, so far, we have tested this promising approach 
on a small patient cohort with excellent results. We have established all the necessary partnerships to fast track clinical translation and do this in a matter of about three years, not 10 or 12. And we have assembled a great team that is absolutely ready to do this. So that now we are ready to start with clinical studies straight away. And over the next two years, we'll include more than 20,000 patients in these studies. With the results of the first couple of thousand patients, which is described as the alpha study there, we'll raise a seed round of 850,000 euros in mid of next summer. And these funds will be used to further scale the reference database, improve the machine learning algorithms, and finally build a software infrastructure that connects the devices to laboratories around these algorithms. And so once the final prototype is completed, we'll conduct a multi-centric double-blind study allowing us to file for the certification in the EU and India. So there we are aiming for the market entry in early 2023, and then expanding to other countries in Europe, other states in India, as well as Japan and the US. So if this sounds interesting to you and you want to be part of saving millions of lives and billions of dollars for the healthcare system, then please reach out to us. Thank you. Thank you so much.